Uh, we are here uh, today uh, at the American Embassy uh, and we've just submitted our petition on behalf of the leadership of the PDP and the poor masses of our country. The need for the international community to come to the assistance of our dear country because Nigeria is a member of Committee of Nations. Nigeria is not an island on itself. It's a member of United Nations. And so when things go wrong, uh, other international community can come to advise. And that's why we are here. And the content of our, our petition is for other international communities should come to the aid of Nigeria and to advise our government to obey the rule of law, especially as it relates to the National Assembly and the judiciary. Uh, over the past few weeks, we have passed through very difficult and challenging times. And you know the case in question is a most state, and we have submitted our petition. We've addressed a press conference on the issue, and as we speak, Mr. President had lost control of security. Our nation is in danger. We are in pain and we're in trouble. And as a party, we cannot keep our hands waiting for the propaganda of the presidency. This country belongs to all, everyone, all Nigerians. And today we backed our minority leader, asking and demand that Mr. President should resign because he has lost control. Absolutely. Around the nation, and you are aware, the media um, uh, personalities. Uh, it is not time for propaganda and it is not time for the presidency to respond to issues that are very sensitive and germane to the nation and the foundation of our country. And when we speak, you will see one of them responding. But they've left the main issues. The issue is that our people are dying and our people are in hunger. You can't travel from here to Kaduna, which is the nearest place to Abuja, you can't travel. You can't go to Mina. You can't travel on, on road. All over the country, the insecurity and the amounts of killings are too much and overwhelming. And I, we believe that the president has lost control. And so the international community should come quickly to the aid of Nigeria. We have the highest IDPs in Africa today as we speak. And yet we are not at war. And that's the mission why we are here.